what we value in people is their you know like their tough story that we always love to listen to a story about how how someone went from having nothing and hardship and got to the very top we always love to hear about the love story that was impossible and then it turned out possible we always love to to hear about the hardship you know like to hear about the alchemy to hear about the transformation in the process we hi there this is not your perfect yogi and this is day two of not your perfect <laughs> no perfect vlogmas i hope you have seen my video from yesterday if you haven't I'm gonna mention that there's a theme here. I'm working through some things, guys. So we're gonna work together through them. Today, the topic that I want to address has to do with transformation, inner transformation. I am at the moment reading a book on alchemy and I'm fascinated. Do you guys know all the new age trends about talking about the law of attraction and so? I've always felt that there's a missing piece to, to all of that and that it goes a bit on the surface. Well, I think the missing piece has to, has to do with alchemy and it comes from ancient A Egypt and it's been transferred through all the cultures of the world. It's been used by all the cultures of the world and it's been at the core of what we call magic and what we call development, human development for thousands and thousands of years now. Yeah, so I'm not gonna go into alchemy because I'm still reading about it. It's gonna be a whole video on it and it's gonna be so good because there's so much there. But I'm gonna touch on it. I'm gonna touch on it from the perspective of what is transformation? What is alchemy? Why do we go through hardship? What, what can we take from it? And today, through listening through the, uh, uh, through the audiobook about alchemy, of course, they mention things that are, we all know them, but we never think of, of these things, like all precious materials. So all um, diamonds, gold, silver, all, uh, all precious uh, things have to usually come through a process of stress, of some sort of stress, of some sort of transformation. They either are put under pressure, it's either something that builds with time through toughness, you know, like pearls in the, <laughs> uh, uh, in the sea, or uh, they have to go through difficult uh, chemical processes that kind of turn them down, clear them up, purify them. So all precious materials, all that we know and value in life as pressures has been undergoing such treatment for, yeah, since, since forever. And that's, that's what we deem va valuable after the end product. Of course, there's ways in which you can go wrong with the alchemy. If you put too much of one thing, if you damage the material, you can, you can go wrong. So I think it's similar in life. What we value in people is their, you know, like their tough story that we always love to listen to a story about how, how someone went from having nothing and hardship and got to the very top. We always love to hear about the love story that was impossible and then it turned out possible. We always love to, to hear about the hardship, you know, like to hear about the alchemy, to hear about the transformation in the process. What we value in people is their, you know, like their tough story that we always love to listen to a story about how, how someone went from having nothing and hardship and got to the very top. We always love to hear about the love story that was impossible and then it turned out possible. We always love to, 
to hear about the hardship, you know, like to hear about the alchemy, to hear about the transformation in the process. We, we love to hear, you know, like you've been through it. You are now valuable at the end of coming out of it. You've been purified. You've been through, let's honestly say it, maybe hell, hell and back. And you survived, you purified your energy through it. You learned how to transform yourself within the process without without tearing yourself apart so this is where 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 it gets dangerous like too much too much damage too much stress can tear it apart but just enough just enough to make the person strong just enough to make the diamond strong just enough to uh, to build up the pearl just enough to rarefy and um, uh, purify uh, things like like silver and gold just enough is is what transforms into you know like precious <laughs> what we value as precious stories that are precious to us we love to know how someone made it from nothing to something we love to know how someone made it from very down low mentally to very high up again in a pure happiness so going back to the discussion of yesterday if you find yourself in a point of where you're asking yourself why me why me why me okay maybe maybe it's just why do you assume that something came to tear you down maybe it's just that purification process maybe it's just that um pressure that you need applied in order to tear apart the the layers that were actually holding you back from being precious maybe it's just the right amount that you need in order to yeah to to become valuable to be able to share with other people to become you know like that one person that has the the diamond story that one person that has the gold <laughs> story so that's today's vlogmas um think when you think of why me think of how could this influence you into turning into something better how or, or think of previous steps in your life when something happened and it actually seemed like the worst thing and it turned out for the better is the one story that you can tell people that you survived is the one thing that you can tell um you have overcome and it's, it's the one thing that kind of prepared you for for the next steps in life it's not it's not damage it's you know like just making you innerly strong and resilient is resilience resilience is what makes us precious so see see where this is taking you see is how this is helping you see what pearls are you taking out through hard times out of you you know like what what's the where's the precious material <laughs> you know like what's what's coming out that's um, valuable even many times art is born out of the hardest situations like poetry music all of this just comes out of that pain and you know like it needs to express itself out of that pain so it might be this <laughs> Okay, guys, until next time, the light in me is the light in you. Namaste. And I'll see you guys tomorrow for no perfect vlogmas. <laughs> bye bye.